So what we're gonna have to do, I'm just gonna start a video without wasting any second. So what you need to do is to click on settings here and uh, here you can go to apps and sales channels and then here you have Shopify app store. And now here in the search bar, we're gonna have to write product product badges all right and i found this app a pretty pretty helpful ha uh, app that's going to help us with badges now we can click on uh, some product badges we can click on install and it's very simple like to install the app click on install and now here we're gonna see this app we can also pin this so every single time we can see this here you know so we don't have to click on apps so we can check the app. we can also click on here and we can see all the apps we installed apps and you know like this as well now we can continue as free with the gold plan you have two badges and labels two banners and plus more images samples animation for badges labor and trust badge right now i'm just gonna test this one the free plan i'm gonna click on continue as free continue as free and then here we have uh, badges and labels i can create a badge or a label new badge is a badge added outside of the, the product image or a label okay so i'm select the bad new badge and uh, now here we have the new badge badge selection text or image i'm gonna go with uh, text and here i'm gonna select i'm gonna write best seller okay you can write here what you want and then we have you can add rotation uh, size and then if you want, you can also customize the text, the font, which is pretty helpful, of course. Uh, shape, maybe you want something like this. And uh, then let's click on save. Now I'm going to close this and then I go with trust. With uh, here we have the badge, but now we're going to need, after we create our new badge, we're going to need to integrate with our theme. All right, and that's the one that I use, so I'll go with that. And uh, here, we're going to see the apps that we have enabled. And if you don't have it enabled, make sure you enabled, and then you click on Save. And uh, now we just need to view online store, and that's pretty much it just make sure you have uh, your product now i don't have any products here but i can add a product add a product uh, just a test product okay and now i can go back to apps i can select this app and i can preview online store and i can see now this product with the bestseller what i just wrote a couple of seconds ago so it works just fine i thought to share this app with you i hope uh, you found this helpful thanks for watching and take care